Hello everybody, my name is Zul, and welcome to my unboxing of the Logitech G930 wireless gaming headset from Logitech. Just got my box in here, shipped from Amazon, showed up actually early somehow, even though they emailed me saying it was delayed, it was on my door, which I find kind of weird. But yeah, let's get into the unboxing. I open this up, uh, but I have not gone any further than this. I just wanted to make sure they didn't misship the package or anything, so... We have the gaming headset itself and my packing slip so we don't need any of that stuff anymore uh, let's see here got my little knife that i always use so i actually had a headset very similar to this it's wireless uh it has onboard charging which i think is pretty damn cool so you can actually have it plugged in and use it at the same time it uses 7.1 surround sound using Dolby technology, so you get that simulated 7.1 effect. It has a built-in mute microphone, so when the boom mic is up, it's muted. Has onboard audio controls. Uh, it has, again, wireless, lag-free, and three G keys on the side of the headset, along with a little mute button there, uh, just in case you want to mute your audio. Or if you want to say, for example, use uh, vent push to talk, uh, you could actually push uh, these buttons here bind them to your push to talk and you can talk while you're a little bit away from the keyboard if you need to go stand up stretch whatever so let's uh, unbox the headset itself uh, so let's see here okay knife here is a little bit dull and I think I need to also get this one there we are so it is Logitech. So I, I've been, I've been, I'm a really big fan of Logitech stuff personally. Uh, I have a lot of Razer peripherals, but uh, I don't know. I wasn't really satisfied with them. I feel like they're a little bit overhyped. So uh, in here we have a um, little paper pamphlet here that's taped to this piece of cardboard that has nothing in it. Uh, what is this? Getting started. Um, I don't think there's any discs. Download the latest drivers from Logitech.com. So that's kind of cool. This is if you've never used a computer before. Uh, it shows you how to plug things into a USB. So for those of you who've never used a computer before, uh, make sure you take a look at the manual. Um, and then for those of you who speak French, uh, here is a French version of that. So good for that okay but the headset itself Ooh, I like the packaging on this here it's pretty it's pretty cool uh, if I knew how to get it out it'd be even cooler oh it's got little oh okay oops so we have a charge dock this is how it plugs in uh, it comes all the way along to the top this sits on your desk and the USB transceiver which is right here just plugs right into the top so that you don't have as far of a distance to travel. Uh, this here is the charging cable. It actually unravels. It gets pretty big. So as you can see right there, uh, it, it gets a bit bigger than that, but it rolls up nicely into this stand so you don't need to worry about, uh, well, you know, you don't need to worry about the tug if you have it on inline mode because you can use it while it's uh, charging. Nice little rubber rubber things on here so this good cable management headset itself Let's take a look at the features uh, so we got a boom mic boom mic right here when it's up it auto mutes so no worrying about that uh, I, I personally like this it's a little bit got some flexibility to it here as we can see uh, there's a little light at the end I'll show you that when I have it actually plugged in and on my head we have a volume on board much better option especially since it's wireless so you can get up and uh, you know just lean back in your chair or whatever listen to some music uh, go to the other side of the room for whatever reason pick something up and you can still change the thing you got a mute button and you got these G keys so if you want to listen to like music or something you could bind these to pause play skip that kind of thing or if you're talking in vent or team speak or something you can bind one of these to your push to talk key so you can just push up on the side of your head and keep the conversation going. It also, uh, as you can see, has a swivel so that it goes it can go straight flat like this because it does not contain a area to hang it up. Uh, it has a metal adjustable band here. Nice satisfying click. 
Uh, so even if you have some sort of weird crazy head where this uh, will fit on you, it'll work. Uh, it will be a bit t tight when you first get it. So, you know, you have to give it a little bit of time to get used to your head. Nice foam here. Uh, these will cover even large ears. Uh, mine are fairly large ears, and this will cover completely on my ears, so you don't need to worry about that. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hook it up to my computer now, and we'll do a quick audio test and see how it works. All right, so I have my G930s working, and they are absolutely fantastic. I will tell you, this sound quality here is a million times better. I have a Razer Tiamat, and it is an absolute steaming pile of crap compared to this headset. The sound quality on this thing is just absolutely amazing. For music, it sounds fantastic. And just in general, this is an absolutely amazing product. So let's take a quick look at the software here, if we can get my screen, this one. Uh, so the, the Logitech gaming software is actually pretty awesome, uh, if we'll take a look here. Uh, so you can rebind the G keys to whatever you want, this is just how it is default. Uh, we'll sort of scroll through here. Uh, I think I'll probably leave it like that for now, I might switch one of them to push to talk or something like that. Uh, it also features some advanced volume controls which are controlled with the... Uh, the onboard audio scroll wheel as we can see here that's what that controls uh, you can adjust the microphone level and a couple of the other things you can crank up the bass the bass is not overpowering on this headset at all which i personally enjoy but it is not too deft and weak like the tiamat or uh, even the turtle beach headset i was using for a while as a stopgap it's a nice headset but still uh, so there's also a little is surround sound. It uses Dolby Simulized surround sound. There's a little button on the side. We don't need to look at that, but it's it's this button. I can turn it off and on. Easy as that. Uh, and it sounds absolutely fantastic. I mean, you just you just have to try it. I, I really like this feature. And it's easy to turn off. Just click of a button and it's gone. But I like it on. It also comes with a couple of voice morphs. Uh, I can sound like a cyborg. Uh, you know, Screaming Bee stuff. Alright, so this is the microphone test for the G930 headset from Logitech. Uh, so what you're hearing right now is me talking through the mic. The quick down brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Is that the sentence I'm supposed to use? I feel like that's wrong, but we're going to go with it anyway. Like I said, it's not the best headset in the world, so if you're planning on doing a lot of video recording, uh, you know, maybe spring for something like a snowball. Uh, I, I personally like it. Uh, this headset is not as good as some of the other ones. It's better than the one on my Tiamat. I honestly just hate that piece of crap. Uh, but that's pretty much it. Um, hope you enjoyed the video so far. Give me a like, dislike. Let me know what you think about my unboxing videos. Um, I know that I've only done two, but would you like to see more? Would you like to see other things like this? Uh, anyway, I think that's about it for now. So uh, I have been Zul. Have an excellent day.